Hello and welcome to this how tech video tutorial. In this video, we're going to show you how to use slicers for pivot tables in Excel 2016. So first we'll need a pivot table. So we'll quickly insert one here and we have videos specifically on creating pivot tables. If you want to look more in depth on that, but we're just going to go through this real quickly, create a nice quick pivot table here, throw in a filter, maybe a couple columns here and there. Move that over a little bit. Definitely need some values as well. And let's see what else do we want. Maybe some rows. Alright, so that should be good for now. And now after we have that, we may want to put in a slicer. And that'll just give us a nice visual representation to help categorize and filter some things out instead of using one of these drop downs here we could just use this slicer. So now we have that nice little visual and we can click whichever we want. And you can see our filter up there that we already have updates accordingly. We can also have multiple regions if we wanted to instead of just one. You can, you can just hold shift as well. And you have some options with the slicer. So this has been a How Tech Video Tutorial. Please like, subscribe, comment, and thank you for watching.